Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a significant move to enhance its military capabilities, Argentina has announced the selection of Elbit Systems Atmos over the Caesar from KNDS, Nexter. The decision follows a comprehensive evaluation process and incorporates the incorporation of 36-wheeled VCA, as reported by Zona Milita on May 9, 2024. The Argentine Army's plan to integrate 72 new self-propelled artillery vehicles to equip its armored artillery groups underscores the nation's commitment to modernize its defense infrastructure. With Atmos and the M109 caused as the preferred options, Argentina aims to replace older artillery systems and align its capabilities with contemporary military requirements. The selection process, detailed in a technical qualification report published on March 11, 2024, meticulously assessed various aspects of the competing systems. During evaluations held on April 27 and 28, 2024, the Army tested the Griffo system, integrating the Atmos platform, against a target drone simulating an enemy aircraft. These tests aim to gauge the system's ability to swiftly engage and neutralize targets, highlighting the urgent need for modern and effective artillery solutions to enhance rapid deployment forces. Developed by Elbit Systems of Israel, the Atmos 2000 is renowned for its mobility and flexibility, being mounted on various truck chassis. Capable of firing all standard NATO 155mm ammunition, including ERFB and cluster munitions, the Atmos boasts ranges of up to 41 km with base bleed rounds. Its rapid deployment capabilities allow it to fire within 30 seconds of halting, with a high rate of fire of 4 rounds per minute in intense firing mode. The modular nature of Atmos enables integration on different wheeled platforms, enhancing operational adaptability. In comparison, the Caesar 155mm self-propelled howitzer from Nexter Systems of France offers strategic and tactical mobility, combining firepower with the maneuverability of a wheeled vehicle. With the capability to fire all NATO standard 155mm ammunition, Caesar achieves maximum ranges of approximately 42 km and up to 55 km using rocket-assisted projectiles. Notable for its rapid deployment, Caesar can be ready to fire minutes after deployment, making it a crucial asset in modern artillery operations. The selection of Atmos over Caesar was influenced by several factors. Atmos's advantageous operational range and suitability for air transport, along with potential local production on an Iveco 6x6 platform, were key considerations. Furthermore, the open technology used in Atmos's ammunition system provided strategic flexibility for future upgrades and interoperability, unlike the closed system of Caesar. Logistical considerations, including ease of obtaining spare parts and supplies, and favorable financing options offered by Elbit, further tilted the scales in favor of Atmos. This decision aligns with regional defense trends, as Atmos was recently selected by the Brazilian army, indicating a move towards greater integration and standardization within South American defense forces. Argentina's choice of Atmos marks a significant step towards modernizing its artillery capabilities, enhancing readiness, and strengthening its defense posture in the region. That's all for now, see you later.